Hi, my name is Janai Lane, founder of Spirit Coach Training. I want to talk to you a little bit about how to hold your own suffering and sometimes others suffering as well. And many of us are feeling a kind of heaviness or a weightiness. Maybe it's what's coming up to be cleared within ourselves or other people's struggles that we love, that we tend to not know how to meet. And one of the things that I've discovered, which is such a simple technique and a, a simple way to meet our suffering, but from a different perspective, energetic perspective. And how we can do that is really best described this way. If you take red dye and you put it in a cup, the whole cup becomes red. But if you take that same red dye and you put it in a lake or a pond, a bigger body of water, the red dye is not turning the whole lake red. And you can meet the red dye, so to speak, in the spaciousness. And we can create an inner spaciousness within ourselves so that as our suffering is happening, or we're meeting another suffering, we can be more expansive. We can be more spacious within ourselves and we can meet it and then hopefully meet it in love and allow it to be transmuted in that love. Now, how do you do this? All right, so one way, one simple, simple technique, okay? Put your hand on your heart, close your eyes if it feels comfortable for you. Breathe, imagine your nose is here. So you're breathing into your heart, breathing in and out. And then what you do is imagine yourself like a, a ball of golden light. And maybe that ball of golden light is, you know, a little bit bigger than your body. What you're gonna do is with each inhale and then exhale, you're gonna expand the ball. So the ball of golden light gets bigger every time it gets bigger. Now you just allow it to get bigger with your intention. So it'll get as big as it needs to be. It'll get as vast as it needs to be as you continue this process of breathing in and breathing out that beautiful golden bubble and breathing in and letting the golden bubble grow even bigger, right? And you can start to feel it because your energy starts to change. You have more inner spaciousness, breathing in and expanding that golden bubble a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger and continuing that process. And I want you to notice how your vibration shifts, your energy changes. So you might go from that red cup to a beautiful clear lake. And the red dye may still be there, but you can hold it in a new way. You have a different perspective and you can, you can meet it. It's not overwhelming you. It's not taking you over. So experiment with this process. Let me know in the comments below how it's working for you. And it takes a little bit of practice, but as you do it, you'll notice a big shift energetically, and then the capacity to transmute the suffering. Thank you so much for listening. I'm sending you so many blessings. Namaste, dear one.